Leverton, um, I, I couldn't really see the point of continuing. Yeah. I'm a firm believer in the notion that you may not agree with what they say, but they've got every right to say it. Here we are in the London Hilton, where later this evening they'll be holding the press awards. Outside we'll be holding, ta-da! The Toxic Media Awards 2018. The media is super important to democracy. It's there to inform. There's some serious issues out there we should be having big debates about. But instead, the toxic media is all about profit for a handful of billionaires. And not only that, when they make their profit, they shove it in a tax haven. The award is going out to today to The Sun for this wonderful article about Jez's jihadi comrades. <laughs> Inspiring racism. This is just a way of divide and conquer. It's a well-known political tool and it impacts people's lives. It's the Daily Express, hey, even worse hey, than the mail. Hey, thank you. What's wrong with racism? Hey. 55 years ago, Max Mosley published this racist pamphlet, but then it's the Daily Mail that's calling out racism here. Fake news goes to the Sun newspaper. Talks Double up. There's, there's no. a lot that media does that's really good. It's yeah. just maybe two or three titles that aren't so great. Well, I'm, I couldn't tell you which ones they are no, off the top no, of my no. head. We are rising up. And we're building towards a week of action that's going to be happening this autumn. It's time to rise up against the toxic media. Pick up a stack of one of these wonderful award-winning papers and just work around and put them down somewhere else. We want an independent fair.